Days of the Week is a super simple song for learning the days of the week and their order. In this song, we sing the days of the week starting on Sunday through to Saturday, three times through, giving students many opportunities to clearly hear the vocabulary and to sing along, trying it out for themselves. Stay tuned until after the song to learn some fun activities you can do with days of the week. Now let's get started. That was Days of the Week. When singing this song, we like to use flashcards, like these from Super Simple, to show students the spelling of the words and where they fall on the calendar. You can also write the days of the week on the board and point to them as you sing, or point to the days of the week on a calendar. This is a great song to sing at the beginning of the day. Try singing the song together and have your students clap or jump when you get to the day of the week it is. You might also have a class calendar that you follow and you can use the days of the week song to point to what day it is today. Singing this song many times will help students commit the days of the week and their order to memory, so use it often. Once your students are familiar with the days of the week, try giving them the days of the week flashcards out of order. Have them work together to put them in the right order, then sing the song to check their work. To make this song more active, try doing a movement on each day, like jumping jacks or hopping. You can also go around the circle having each student sing one day of the week, and when you get to the day of the week it is, that student can do a special movement, like spin or jump. For another fun active activity, Spread the flashcards on the floor in order and then stand in a line next to Sunday and jump as a group to Monday, Tuesday, and so on, jumping day to day as you sing. Next, mix the cards up so they're out of order and so students have to jump back and forth to get to the next day. If you have a large class, you can have students do this one or two students at a time and the rest of the class can sing days of the week together. For a fun circle time game, try this clapping activity that is great for practicing the days of the week. Have your students sit in a circle with their hands facing palm up. One hand will be on top of the person's hand next to them, and the other hand will be underneath the other person's hand on the other side of them. Have one student start the game by saying Sunday and clapping the hand of the student to the right. That student will then say the next day, Monday, and clap the hand of the student to their right. Continue around the circle saying the days of the week and clapping until you get to the end, Saturday. Then you can try again, going faster and faster or switching directions. For an added challenge, every time a student says the day of the week it currently is, the next student should try and move their hand before it can be clapped. If they are able to remove their hand before it is clapped, then the student who said the current day of the week it is, is out of the game and the circle gets smaller. 
If the student who said the current day of the week is able to clap the hand of the next student, then the next student is out. If the current day of the week is early on in the week, you can also play using the last day of the week, Saturday, as the special day to try and remove your hand. Continue the game starting at Sunday again until there's only one student left. Once two students have been eliminated from the game, they can start their own game and welcome more students as they get eliminated from the first game. We hope you enjoy the days of the week. Keep on singing, learning, and having fun. Thanks for watching. Be sure to check out supersimple.com for more songs and resources. If you have ideas for how to use this song in the classroom or at home, let us know in the comments. And be sure to subscribe for more teaching tips.